Okay, today uh, I'm going to show you how simple it is to uh, create a text to speech machine in Google Colab. Just two blocks of Python codes can achieve this objective. Uh, however, the purpose of uh, demonstrating this text to speech function is because I emphasized that the first generation of intelligence is automation and the fifth uh, generation of intelligence is machine learning. So last time we have already demonstrated how to use Google Colab to uh, carry out some kind of machine learning coding. Well, uh, today I would like to show you what do I mean by automation uh, so as to illustrate the difference between automation and machine learning. Because automation is a rule-based approach. So we know the result and then instruct the machine to uh, do the task automatically on our behalf, this automation. So same example, now I'm going to demonstrate how we can convert text to speech, which does not require any learning process because we have already input the whole dictionary, uh, all words for the machines to find and uh, convert the text to speech. The machine does not have to learn anything, but it can help us to read the text automatically. So it's so simple. Let me show you. First of all, we have to in so pip install and uh, Google have already built in a text to speech library called GTTS. So once you play command, then it will show you uh, the installation of this uh, Google text to speech program. Okay, successfully installed it. The next block of Python code is simply to provide audio display. So we, uh, first of all, import the ETS, then from ipython.display, we import the audio function, and then we simply type what we want the machine to read. Say, for example, now I would like to ask the machine to say hello to you and introduce myself. So then we save these into a file and then the audio will keep this file and play yeah, that's it just these two block of coding then it will read all the text you type in let's play hello i am edward you how are you see it's so amazing the purpose of this youtube is to demonstrate what are the differences between automation and machine learning uh, because in this case we rely on the accuracy of this gtts to read all the text so let's say if i type something that the machine cannot understand that means gtts does not contain then let's see what will happen let me say i type chinese <laughs> interesting <laughs> but uh-huh then let's try if we type something really nonsense a-s-d-w-r-r-d-s-a-s -S -S. so you will find that indeed that is the rule okay 